Hi guys, it's Willie. So I wanted to just do a little video and show you the dried results from some cloud pour mix, cloud mix tests that I did. I did post the images in a community post and said like, pick which one. And I, I could only do four, but there were actually five versions. So I'm just gonna show you the dried results now, and then I'm gonna leave all the recipes in the description box below. And yes, some of these use satin enamel. So, um, and also too, when I painted these, I mixed them and then used them almost immediately. I think they may be set for an hour. So keep that in mind. Um, I'm sure the longer you let these sit, the better the cloud mixes will be. And I am gonna be doing a larger, larger, longer video with um, where I'm actually painting using two of these recipes. So, and like I said, well, I'm gonna say that <laughs> some of these recipes aren't new. They're just ones that I've used in the past or other people have used in the past, just to give you guys some idea. Okay, so this is option one. So, and the one thing I look for with like the clouding is that it's not grainy or it splits when it dries, or it looks chalky. And that's why, for the longest time, I didn't love using the satin enamel because it can look chalky, you know? It just can. And that's why the Vallejo Pearl Medium is still my all-time favorite. Anyway, this is number one. Um, the sides, I guess I'm just looking, showing you that there's no splitting. Um, you're gonna get a little bit of color stuff there but nothing major so yeah this is number one definitely stronger line clouding more opaque but good option okay so then number two which I have behind me um this is number two I don't know which maybe like that <laughs> so No splitting, covers nicely, doesn't really look chalky or grainy. I like this one. Um, and this is a recipe that uses satin enamel. So it's a really simple recipe. And that's my thing too, with all these recipes, I wanna get down to the simplest recipe, like three ingredients top. Like, I just, I just, we all have so many recipes and I think the simplest, way to do it is sometimes the best. So anyway, that is number two. I'm gonna put this on pause and be back with the other ones. Okay, you guys, so this is number, <laughs> this is number three. So you definitely have some transparency, you definitely have some opacity. I didn't love what it did through here and that just could, could be because it didn't sit for days on end. Um, but this is a good option as well. Yeah, no splitting. I don't think I have much of the white down on the sides. Yeah. So there's three. Okay, hold on. So then four, oh gosh. Okay, so this is four. Some of you, I don't think I put this picture up when I did my two community posts. This is number four, just because I, I wish I would have reported it because um, the, the cloud area where I used the white, it kind of, it's pretty minimal. So I was like, I feel like I didn't really get a good um, representation. I feel like I could have poured it a little better even though these were tests, but it's not grainy. Um, well, maybe a little bit. So anyway, that is number four, right? Yes, okay, so here's number five coming up. So this is number five. And there is some 
kind of cool ethereal haziness happening on this side but then on this side the lines around the clouding are much more um uh strong that's not the right word you know what i mean the the lines are just more defined more defined that's better so no splitting these all dried beautifully so that is number five okay so i'm gonna put all the um recipes in the description box below and pardon me you guys i'm totally like antihistamine head right now so i'm having a hard time speaking but i'll just let you know my favorites um are uh one my favorites so far are one two let's see it almost looks blown out in the camera one two and then number five so those are my favorite recipes other than the Vallejo Pearl Medium. So again, guys, let me know what you think. Um, drop any comments below. Again, I will be testing out one, three, and five some more, um, you know, in the upcoming times, especially since the Vallejo Pearl Medium, you're not able to get it right now. And I did write Vallejo and they said that they are having a hard time getting one of the raw materials for the pearl medium. So that's why it's back ordered in back stock. And then one of you guys, um, oh gosh, I forget who said it. I'll have to go back and look, but they said that they just bought a bottle over in Greece and the price had raised and that they had changed the packaging. So that makes, you know, that can delay things as well. So, um, but I think these are all great options um, until the pearl medium comes back because it's my favorite just it is <laughs> so anyway thanks guys so much for watching this and um yeah again leave me a comment below um which one you like the best and uh yeah so i will see you soon i'm gonna be doing some more videos really really soon here okay thanks guys bye